Hi, my name is Karen and this is my story. I was raised in an unchurched home by a mother who, um, she was a widow at age 38 with three young children. She didn't believe in God because of all the loss she had suffered in her life. I was um, sent to private school when I was young, so I was exposed to religious education. Um, so I heard about God. I learned about God, but I did not have a relationship with God. Um, I was afraid of God. I thought God was punishing. And um, I just didn't believe in the loving God that I believe in today. I started using drugs at a young age. And uh, I didn't get clean until I was 38 years old. I'm not really here to talk about my recovery, but I am more than happy to share that one-on-one. -on -one. If you'd ever like to talk about it, come find me. Um, through the process of people I met in a 12-step fellowship, I was introduced to the Christian church. I didn't really understand what the pastor was preaching from the stage, but I was um, drawn into it. Um, the first thing that kept me going back was the worship band. I uh, had never been exposed to the rock and roll style of Christian music. You know, I was only familiar with hymns, and um, that wasn't it for me. Um, so the music was what kept me coming back at first, and then you know I started to form a relationship with a kind and loving Jesus Christ that I know today as my Savior. I, uh, when I came to ACC, I was introduced. Um, to some women and I got into a life group and all I can say is those women have held me up for the past three years um, through a lot um, but most especially um, two things actually I relapsed on pain medicine after surgery and then just this past year uh, my uh, mother passed away after a long battle of dementia. And I really, really struggled through um, her last months um, because I knew that she wasn't a believer and I just didn't know what was going to happen, if I was ever gonna be reunited with her, um, if I was ever gonna see her again. But um, through the help of my life group and the pastors at ACC and the staff at ACC, I am continuing to grow in my faith I do still consider myself in infancy because there's so much more that I need to learn. Um, but I'm not going to give up. I'm going to keep on trucking. And thanks for listening to my story.